Hi, my name is Katie, and we're going to talk about how to pick out the right eyeshadow for brown eyes. I have a lot of people who always come to me and say, I want my eyes to pop. And, or they say, I have brown eyes, blue eyes, what colors work for me? And realistically, there are some colors that are going to complement your eye shade. And when I say complement, you almost want to start thinking about the color wheel because it goes right back to where colors are on the color wheel whether or not they're across from each other, those are colors that are gonna complement your eye, the contrast between the two. So for someone with brown eyes, there's a couple different options that are gonna work really, really well to really set off that color. And those colors are purples, those colors are blues, cool tones, silvers, grays, blacks, all are gonna look fantastic with a brown eye. And you can always do a smoky brown eye as well and do that kind of monochromatic look and it's gonna pick up on the tones within your eye and just make them look extremely intense. So today with our model Judith, we're gonna do a kind of smoky, fun, purple eye. So first things first, I like to prep the eyelid, eyelid with some eye base. And I'm just using a neutral color, because if you're gonna get an eye base, you should get one that you can use every single day. Because what eye base does, I'm just gonna have you close, is it gives you a clean lid, and it evens out the skin tone, it covers all the redness, the tiny veins, but what it also does is it forms a double-sided tape to any product you put on so that you don't get that gross, creasy eyelid that is very unbecoming. So really just use a brush or your finger to shear it out all the way across the lid, all the way up to the eyebrow. Next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go in with a little bit of eyeliner and I'm gonna use an eye coal. An eye coal is any eyeliner that's safe to be put on the waterline. And we're just gonna to touch right here at the lash line. We're just gonna put a little bit of this liner on the bottom waterline. And I like to use my finger to kind of smudge it a bit. And we're just gonna fill in right here on the upper waterline as well. This is a great trick to make your lashes look longer. So we're just gonna put a little liner in the outer corner of our eye. I'm gonna have you look down or close. And we're just gonna use the side of the liner and gently a little bit right onto the lash line and I'm going to use my finger and give it a soft smoky smudged look. Now we're going to go in with some color. I'm going to start with a light mid-tone purple color using a flat brush to pack it on. We're just going to pack this beautiful purple right on the lid and always focus on getting the color as close to the lash line as possible because you don't want to have a space, a gap between your lash line and your lid where it's just kind of flesh tone because you missed it. We're kind of diffusing the color so that it's darkest at the lash line and then letting it just kind of blend outwards. I'm going to take a little bit of this shadow and put it right under the lash line as well. Now what you have here is a one color eyeshadow with liner. What's really gonna make this eye pop is the contrast of a different color contouring the eye. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a fluffy brush and we're gonna pick up some shadow with this, something matte. And I'm gonna start with a medium tone because we can always go back and make it darker. And we're gonna start where we want the most color, which is right here, and we're just gonna start blending. And this is where her crease is right here. So depending on how dark you wanna make this look, or where you want to put the color, you can go right into that crease like so and really cut it out. Just taking the time to blend is so important. A lot of people just aren't patient. They're like, why isn't my eyeshadow blended? Well, you didn't blend it. It takes time. We're going to bring that color under the eye as well. I love to use my finger like so to just kind of soften the edges. Okay, we'll do the other eye. Then you're gonna to wanna to do some kind of highlight as well, something to soften this look. So I'm gonna use a nice light color. I'm just gonna brush this under the lash, or excuse me, under the brow. Have you look down, maybe a touch in the corner of the eye. And we're using this brush because we don't want a ton of product. And what would this be without mascara, right? And then this is a great point to kind of clean up underneath the eye if you've made a little mess. Then you can come back in with a little bit of powder or concealer and really just clean up underneath the eye. So as you can see, the purple eyeshadow looks fantastic with brown eyes. But just to remember when you're applying these shadows is you want to use 
three different colors, something that's gonna be a little bit more matte, less shiny, that's your contour color. That's what you're gonna use to add depth to the eye. You're gonna put that in the places that you want to recede. Then you're gonna want something that you can do a wash of color all across the lid with. We chose a mid-tone purple with a little bit of flecks of gold to go with her lovely tan. And then definitely some kind of highlight, something soft, shimmery, but not too frosty, because frost is bad if it's all over your face. And so we chose this really soft, um, satin finish cream shadow and we just brushed it underneath the brow in the corner of the eye and right across the lid. Top it off with some mascara, your favorite, and you're ready to go out and hit the town. And that's the best way to compliment some brown eyes.